Now, see here, this funny carving. Now, that's Dando, that is. And those sausage things, well, there is dogs here in St. German's Church. And that's to remind us of how easy it is to go to the devil. Because it's amazing how often the devil crops up in Cornish stories, you know, and everybody got their favorite. How the devil leapt or slept here and playing his fiddle or his pipes and getting into the cream and the butter, turning people to stone. Well, I never come across this one about Dando before till I came here in the spring working in Cornish schools and I met Mr. Davis, the headmaster of St. German's County Primary School. And he told me the story. Well, of course, the children here, they... They know the story all along. But we thought how nice it would be if we could bring Dando back to life. So the children got busy making and painting all sorts of things. Richard Gendel, he wrote a song, and I'm going to tell the story. And this year, Dando was a monk, but he was a very bad monk. Because all he ever wanted to do was to cuss and swear and drink and go on to him with his oars and hounds. Not lead a life of prayer in St. German's Priory like all the good monks. Now this Sunday morning, Dando was down to Earth Barton, hunting as usual. And coming back, he wanted still more wine. And he cursed his poor servants because they had no time to prepare more for him. More wine, he said, more wine. Go get me some from hell if you can't find any here. Whereupon, a dark stranger stepped up and he offered his flask. And Dando grabbed the bottle and he drank it all up. Immediately, he fell to the ground, cursing and swearing, oh, he was in some tear. Well, then the stranger, who, of course, was the devil, jumped on Dando's horse, pulling Dando up with him, and with all the hounds running behind, yelping and baying, off they went like lightning down to the river liner and disappeared. And they'd never been seen from that day to this. Some story, Anna. Now, Dando was a monk and a pretty bad too. He never would behave as a monk ought to do. While all his brethren went to church to pray, he'd be riding with his hands down to the The day was hot, he'd be calling out for wine, as water wouldn't do for a thirst so fine. For all his servants, t'was more than they could do to be bleeding of the vine for an extra chill or two. When the stranger, dark and tall, pushed his way from among Come take a drink of mine, cried the stranger, her sly And Dando seized the flask and he drained it dry Then like two fiends they backed before the grave Till Dando with an oath from his horse fell away stranger soar and set the sorry monk on the saddle before and down the hill they galloped like the wind till the waters of the liner they gathered in behind